Alright, if you thought that sounded good, you can thank my newly acquired Weissa Sound Send unit. Focus the camera here. Turn your smart TV into the center of your home theater. Connects to your TV via HDMI ARC. HDMI cable is even included. This can do Dolby Atmos and Dolby Audio. Hold this here for a second. You can pause it if you want to read it. But as you can see from the features here, connects to your TV via ARC or eARC, supports 2.0 to 7.1, and then it does Dolby Atmos for 312 or 512 configurations. Can take Dolby Digital, Dolby Digital Plus, Dolby True HD, Dolby Surround, and Dolby Atmos. Will not take DTS audio. Uh, it's got app controls for base management. Uh, you can adjust for individual channel trim, lip sync, lip sync delay. It can all be controlled by the app for your Android or iOS device. It can be hooked up with HDMI, ARC, or the optical audio port on your television or projector and it has a micro USB for power so give you a little closer look here at the unit I got it rigged up right here so I got an HDMI cable and then my uh, USB for power a little simple wipes the logo on it a little connect button bottom side of it does have a screw hole if you want to wall mount it otherwise it's got nice little feet here so I just temporarily rigged it up here let me show you the back of the projector okay as you can see here on the back of the projector it's got the one HDMI cable going in to my LG With the HU70 LAB. This does also have an optical audio out, which I will be testing that later to see how it works. So, as you see, if I go into my LG projector, audio is set to HDMI ARC. So, as I move, you're getting your audio. Back out of 
here. Set that remote down. As you can hear, it easily makes sound no matter what I'm doing on the Xbox. And go into, let's see here. Should be able to load this. As you can see, it. LG projector automatically goes to instant game response due to its ALLM auto low latency mode. Let's lock that back in. Dim the lights back down. Sound is currently coming out of the Platin Audio speakers that I reviewed previously. I'm going to turn the volume down using the basic LG remote. Turn the sound level going down. Indicated on the screen. So my projector remote, or what would be your TV remote, can control the volume via arc. And like I said, it's still using the Platin Monaco 5.1 surround sound that I originally reviewed. You see, I got one speaker right here. Front right up here. Center channel, front left, a subwoofer, and my rear left. All playing audio seamlessly with each speaker just plugged into a power outlet for power. So, if you can easily get yourself this sound send transmitter, uh, I believe it retails for about 180 and then get yourself either the Platin Monaco 5.1 system that you can actually order with the sound send unit. Or you can buy any of the actual WISA certified speakers and pair it to the SoundSend unit. So, the SoundSend unit plus any five to seven WISA enabled speakers and one subwoofer. And you can have yourself a nice home theater system without the need of an AVR. 
So, if you want to put a little more money into your speakers, feel free to check out the WISA enabled speakers. I will leave a link in the description for all the products. So, hope you enjoyed and thanks for watching.